The surest way to fail at business is to avoid all the hard things. And there's this principle that if you avoid hard things in business, they control you. They become the master of you. And I see this happening to too many good entrepreneurs, too many online coaches who want to be successful, but they avoid the hard. They avoid the discomfort. They avoid what I call the monsters in their business. And this is something that actually, when I was going through therapy, I learned a lot about is that you have to face the monster. You have to face the hard things, the difficult, uncomfortable things. Because if you don't, they will control you. And if you do face them, you become the one in control and you are allowed then to steer yourself in the direction that you wanna go. It's hard because as humans, as soon as we hit resistance or discomfort, we're creatures of comfort. We don't like that. And this is the reason why a lot of people are never successful. A lot of people never have a long-term business. A lot of people don't have great health, great whatever it is. Face the heart today. My, therapy, my therapist has told me, face the monster every single day. It's the same thing in business. Once you push through the resistance, that's usually where a lot of people say the magic happens, right? Basically, what you're avoiding, that's where the magic is. That's where the results are. And here's the funny thing. As you push through resistance, thinking about a year or two ago when I was pushing back through resistance, when I was only doing six figures, multiple six figures, like seven, eight years ago, those problems, those monsters that I was facing at that point, now I just don't feel like monsters at all. They feel like small, insignificant things that I should have just pushed through quicker. But that's not how us humans work. We always think that the problems and the monsters we're facing right now are massive. As soon as we get past them, we're like, oh, it's not that bad. It's the whole saying of fear is a mile wide and an inch deep. You dive right in, it's not that bad actually. You go through the discomfort, it's not that bad actually. You become stronger. And when you become stronger, then things become easier and you can face the next monster. As one of my mentors once told me, every new level has its own devil. So you gotta learn how to fight them, no matter when or where. If you wanna continue to grow, continue to be successful. It's just part of the game.